Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So today we're going to watch and react on the fifth episode of the TV show The Originals. Um, in the previous episode, um, it's still um, Klaus and Rebecca trying to get back Elijah, who is a um, prisoner of uh, the witch Davina. Um, we learn more about Davina, who is hiding from the witch. We which is we still don't know why uh, we know that she loves a boy and Klaus used that boy obviously to get what he wants from her and um, we know more about Kami, her twin bro brother who uh, killed uh, a few uh, people and killed himself after that and she thinks that maybe it's that it's demons or Vampires complaining him to do so, and uh, obviously Klaus compelled her to forget about this and live her life, and promised her that he would find out what happens and stuff. Um, Agnes, the witch, uh, betrayed them, and uh, Elijah, um, Hilly, sorry, was. Um, hurt but uh, the baby uh, healed her inside and uh, yeah that's basically what happens oh and Elijah is awake so we will see what Elijah's plan is with Davina let's go you're the one they call honorable He's like so hungry in his blood. <laughs> you don't look well. Well, only this morning I had a mystical dagger embedded in my chest, so I'd say I'm holding myself together quite well. Wait, it's gonna be enough? Apparently, it's enough. Okay. Didn't know just a job would be enough. That's something interesting. S Sabine stupidly told them about some vision she had about the baby. What kind of vision? How, may I ask, was this particular vision interpreted? Pretty much that your baby would bring death to all witches. Seriously? Not for a second. Sophie. What are you doing? Saving the community you renounced. You're all ridiculous, Monique. Seriously? Your mom told me I had to. Yeah. Well, your mom and I are gonna have words. What? That's why she's hiding. Because they want her dead with the others. Damn. I prefer for Marcel's informant not to find anything that would lead him back to us, to her, or to, you know, that. You are all class. <laughs> Good news, little D. I don't need to be there. I'm moving you out of this pile of dust. Are you serious? When? You didn't reveal that I was awake. We're not done talking yet. Made me and my friends do this harvest ritual. They said our participation would bring our family strength, health. And we'd forever be celebrated as saviors of the community. But all they really wanted was more power. So I left before they could get it. So what does it take to complete this ritual? I have to die. Now I understand why she's hiding. She's hiding to stay alive. Hey, what the hell? You're going out there anyway, aren't you? 
Two can play the follow game, you know. You heard Klaus, he and Marcella heading right where you're going. So distract them. Because unless you want to lock a hormonal pregnant werewolf in a tomb, I'm coming with you. And wouldn't Elijah be mad if he hears that the baby and I died of asphyxiation? <sighs> to which is Sophie is just annoyed. How did you meet her? <laughs> That might surprise you. This was eight months ago, before I banned the witches from using magic. Relations between vampires and witches uh, weren't what you call friendly by any means, but let's just say we were a little less divided. In fact, some of us were getting along just fine. Oh, yeah. Okay. With Sophie, them. You and Sophie, you hypocrite. <laughs> mm. What did she do? She did what any good girl would do. She went to her priest. You've never cared about witch business, Sophie. And now you have the gall to reveal our private dealings to an outsider. You have to find another way. You think we do this lightly? The vampire presence in the quarter is growing stronger. We need more power to fight them off. Harsh times call for harsh measures. This is a little more than harsh, Bastiana. You don't understand because you don't believe. You've never believed. But I believe enough to put everything on the line for this. And being chosen for the offering, it's an honor. It's your fucking daughter. What the fuck? What you are planning goes too far. We are simply taking what we need. Our connection to our ancestors weakens over time. You sow and you reap. Come on, you can't do this. The witches have in this town. Do you really want to face Marcel without me? Because that is what you'll be dealing with if you go through with the harvest. Is everything okay in your Uncle Kieran? We were just finishing, Sean. Right? I believe I've made myself clear. We'll take this matter to the elders. Continue your study, Sean. Your uncle is an excellent role model. The shuffle. Oh my god. Sophie tells me that the witches put a hex on his nephew, Sean. Made it seem like he was slowly losing his mind in order to distract Kieran while they kept planning for the harvest. So they attacked Kieran's nephew. Yeah. Kid wasn't the same after that. He's gonna kill Agnes, for sure. What did you mean when you said you had to die? That's what the harvest was. They said they'd put us four girls in a state of, like, peaceful limbo as part of the offering. And then later, at the reaping, we'd awaken and be reborn. I never got as far as the limbo part, which means the harvest is incomplete. That's why the witches are so freaked out. The reaping's just around the corner, and if they don't finish it before then, it's over. All I have to do is wait it out. And then what? They're punished. And I'm free. For Marcel? Of magic. I'll be normal. And is that what you want? To be normal? I just don't want to be what I am. I can't control it sometimes. The magic. I and I just really trying to understand her and think it's gonna help her. Who's there? What the hell? An original? Let me understand this. Against all logic, you and Haley went to the bayou where you ran into a man you think may be Marcel's informant, and then you lost him. Yes. And now that we've established that I am a failure as a sister, and a friend, and an original, you should probably know he's on his way to Marcel right now to wrap me out. Skinny guy in a hurry. Looks like he saw a ghost. I'll handle it. I need a distraction. <laughs> I'm on my way. We were let out like princesses. My mother was so proud. Our magic fades. 
As our ties to our ancestors weaken over time, we beseech them accept this What offering fuck? as a sign of our faith. Bastiano, one of the elders, called upon the four elements to bind our past and future magic together. Earth, to connect us to our ancestors. Water, to heal the community. Wind, to carry us to our ancestors and back. Fire, to purify. Yeah. After all our preparation, we knew exactly what to expect. For weeks they told us that the magic and the knife they used to cut our palms would put us to sleep, and that later at the reaping, we would all be resurrected. They said we'd awaken and all be together and more powerful than ever. And it was just like we rehearsed it. All that was left was a little cut on our palms for the blood sacrifice. No, stop! Bastiana, stop! You have to stop, Bastiana! Please don't do this! <laughs> Even after Sophie tried to stop it, we didn't suspect anything. To be born, you must sacrifice. Do you have faith? <laughs> What the fuck? Everyone involved in the ritual knew that this would happen except the four of us they weren't putting us to sleep they were slaughtering us <laughs> no no monique devil no 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 i begged for someone to help my own mother turned away from me i can't believe so we screamed and screamed for her sister anyone to do something you need her mother But no one did. Yet you survived. Therefore, someone or something intervened. Yes. Someone finally did. Unique, run away! Run away! Thank you, Martha. Martha. I got you. There was something about seeing Davina fight. She didn't just go along to the slaughter, you know? I do. Marcellus. The harvest was actually working. Something was working. And I knew that I was supposed to be killed so the harvest could be completed and we would all be resurrected. But they lied to us about how they were killing us. How do I know they weren't lying to us about coming back? Hmm. Oh, isn't this like old times? Just how drunk are you two? Skating on the razor's edge. Why else would I be here? I don't know. Maybe to make sure I didn't get too drunk and spill secrets better left unspilled about you and me. Mm. I know better. I hope so. Because you don't want to end up on the wrong side of me. Oh, Rebecca Michelson. You do not want to be on the wrong side of me. There's so much tension between those two. I don't even know if I'll see him again. What the hell is going on? <laughs> This power that you contain, drawn from your fallen friends, it's too much for you. You need control, which requires study and practice. My mother was a very powerful witch. 
She left behind her grimoire as a legacy of books filled with spells. These books contain all of the tools that you might need to control your magic. If you free me from here, I can share them with you. However, if you leave now with Marcel, we'll never see each other again. And I cannot find you, and I can't help you. The witch has manipulated me. You know how that ended. This is not manipulation. This is one thing in exchange for another. I'm offering you a deal. I think she can trust him. What's wrong? What's happening? I don't know. Something's wrong. She's good at pretending. Now what? You're just gonna leave her up there for anybody to find? I'm not in the mood, Kieran. You were supposed to get her out of New Orleans after the harvest. We failed those other three girls. We didn't fail her. That is why I came to you for help. That was the plan. Plans change. Especially after you find out how powerful she was. Let's get something straight. For eight months since you left, I've been running this town just fine. I don't need you coming back and getting in my business. I will do what I want, where I want. Got it? You want to be the boss? You want to call the shots? Fine. But I call the shots with the humans. And you don't want to make an enemy of me. So, I would suggest one thing. Stay away from my niece. Fine. The hell's your niece? Cammy. The harvest ritual. You said you didn't believe in it. Were you right? No. I saw it with my own eyes. It was working. It was real. So how can you be so sure Sabine's vision isn't? Mm -hmm. She is weird. Taking me on a field trip to distract me. Pathetic and obvious. I taught you better than that. You taught me to protect what's mine. You will not take Davina from me. End of story. An immutable law of nature, Marcel, is the strong always take from the weak. Oh, if you were so strong, you wouldn't have run away from New Orleans like a little bitch all those years ago. You've been playing king with a bunch of children for too long. Don't mistake me for one of your Nightwalker lackeys, Marcel. I can take Davina any time I like. Do forgive me, Marcel. If anyone is to teach my brother a lesson, it's me. <laughs> Close face, like, oh, shit. Vic, finally, what? I buried your face in the heart of the deep well. Family reunion. <laughs> Mm. They both will want Ellie. Who them? I swear, I had no idea that the harvest could possibly be real. But the one thing that you were sure of is that I was wrong, and that I would risk Monique's life on a maybe. And now my daughter is dead. 
Please tell me how to fix this. Now that Marcel has Davina, how are we even supposed to find her? If we don't finish the harvest, Monique and those two other girls are dead for real. Look at me. You and I are going to find a way to get Monique back. It'll be our little secret. We'll do it together. We'll seal off the cemetery from the vampires, find Davina, stop Marcel, and finish the ritual once and for all. Even if I have to slit Davina's throat myself. No, we, I knew we couldn't trust her. Well, that was a very, very good episode. We learn, and uh, we know now, the, uh, I know now, um, why uh, Davina is hiding from the witches and why she um, is very important. We know that Sophie is not someone you can trust. Basically, she has been lying to the originals from the start and um, they, she wants Davina and yeah I really love Davina. I don't want her to die. I don't. I really don't want her to die. I really love her. Mm. I love that Elijah wants to help her. I ho I really, really hope that he didn't lie to her, and if that is really going to help her and give um, uh, his mother's books to her, the books will. Um. Yeah, that was basically centered on this. Oh, yeah, and we know that um, Camille's twin was really not crazy, but she, that 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 poor guy was um, that put that poor guy was just um, under a spell, and then Klaus will kill that picture of Agnes I if he doesn't help someone does um, anyway uh, thank you for watching uh, tell me in the comments what you thought about this episode what you think is gonna happen no spoilers please and uh, don't forget to subscribe and leave a thumbs up and I will see you very soon for another reaction until then take care bye bye